Big Daddy here, and today we're going to take a look at one of the fastest menus on the planet, the Brisk Menu. So let's get started. So the first thing that you're going to see or realize when you click on this menu is it's ridiculously fast. Oh my gosh. It is the or one of the fastest menus on the planet. I mean, there's no two ways about it. It is absolutely instant when you click on it for it to open. So once it's open in the blink of an eye, you have a search box up at the top and then you have your categories on the left so you have, it's defaulted to all so you're able to scroll through your applications now the search box will become invaluable once you start adding more and more programs on here because for right now you can scroll to the bottom very easily but this is a freshly installed uh, Solus OS, Solus Mate version. So there's not that many programs installed on it. Once you install them, obviously you're going to have a harder time trying to find what you're looking for, and that's where the search box comes in. It is just as instant to find programs as the menu is coming up. The menu is instant the search functionality is instant um, and I have tried mostly all of them out there and this is probably the best implementation yet so you have your categories and you have a shortcut to the control center you have a shortcut to the software center and you have your power options log out lock and power off so it's a basic menu, but what it does is it adds speed on top of functionality. And on top of that, it's built with beauty. It's built to look good and still give you the speed and functionality of a, of a absolutely awesome menu. So right now, that's what's that's what it gives you let's look at the page here the github page and check what it says all right so right now it's keyboard centric but um it does not work with the super key as of yet right now the shortcut for it is control f10 so i'm sure that they're going to be working on that and trying to implement that but um that would definitely be a plus uh, stupid fast I mean I don't know how much better you can it's ridiculously fast it's stupid fast I have this perfect perfect analogy of what it is um, you have your searching in your categories and tells you a little bit about it but here's the plan features so persistent storage of settings the next thing you have is the option to disable category icons for modern look so that's the one of the planned items so I'm not sure how this is going to actually look when you disable the categories. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to dream about what it's going to look like or what their plan is. Um, I don't know if they're going to do like a bigger icon set and maybe have it look like a slingshot or if they're just going to have two rows of this or maybe they're just, it's just going to shrink down to one row of your scroll. I don't know. Don't know how they're going to do it, but I can't wait to see what it is. Um, the configurable menu button and icon applet. So basically it'll allow you to uh, configure a icon of your own and maybe take the label off if you don't want it or be able to rename it. A favorite, favorite capability. So I would assume um, that that would mean that you would be able to drag and drop uh, icons over here to have your favorites but either way they're going to give you favorite options not exactly sure how it's going to be implemented but it's on its way which is something that it sorely needs 
and improved styling for the Windows Edge and the search entry. So they are working on the styling for this. So all in all, it is an awesome menu to start out with. And they're planning on adding a ton of features to it. So I would love to see maybe uh, a category, not a category icon, but a icon type view instead of the list view, maybe an icon view. Um, maybe with bigger icons. I would love to see more settings involved in it so you could maybe, you know, depending on where you have the menu, maybe put the search at the bottom, maybe flip the categories to the right. It, possibilities for um, what you can do and what you can't do. Because I prefer my menu at the top of the screen, so not exactly uh, the whole panel, so to speak. So, um, it's definitely something to look forward to. Uh, I would love to see, like I said, the favorites. I can't wait for that. That was one of my must haves for plans. But all in all, this menu is absolutely awesome. Ike Darty has done a fabulous job at not only coding it, but having the vision to make it look good and having the functionality be great. So, I, I suggest all of you guys go over to the Solus webpage, the GitHub page, and give your support and maybe even install Solus Mate and check the Brisk menu out. So I can't wait for the new updates to come out, and I look forward to see what's going to happen with it. But right now, it is the fastest menu on the planet. So until next time. Big Daddy out.